So I just walked down from where I got changed thinking I was recording and I didn't hit record. So here I am, I'm at uh, Long Beach, which is uh, in Saladan. And you've seen a few photos of this beach. I like this beach, there's not a lot of uh, crap on the beach. They clean it up, there's not a lot of rocks and stuff like that. It's in a nice setting, you can see up there. That's basically the island. That ridge runs 30 kilometers, and that's the island with uh, flat either side beaches. On the other side, it's more a quiet bay. Yeah, so here I am. I'm going in the water. It's uh, looking pretty good. Water's crystal clear. The water is crystal clear. It's about half tide. So, uh, I'm using the GoPro, I'm not using the uh, iPhone. Uh, I don't know if the latest iPhones can go in the water like the XR I used to have could go in the water, which was uh, really good. But yeah, I just want to have my morning dip in the ocean. As you can see, there's a few tourists getting around now. The season is just starting here. So, yeah, there's quite a few tourists. I want to keep an eye on my uh, stuff up there near that log. You see that little red towel up there? That's my stuff there. I've got my iPhone, blah, blah, blah. Just want to keep a bit of an eye on it, but it should be okay. Okay, so going in the water, and look at it. Look how crystal clear it is. Look at this. Just beautiful. Long tail boat out there, probably getting ready to take some people out for diving or out to Kopipi. Can't see much out on the horizon today. Oh, I can see Pipi over there, but it's uh, a little bit hazy. Anyway, I've got to go in the water. I've got to go in the water now. Oh. it's really really clear crystal clear really enjoying it here I'm telling you it's probably one of the best moves I've ever made coming here I really like Atlanta I like my little house out in the bush my house is back up that way in where the dip is uh, and there's a bit of a mountain behind that one over there and that's where my house is on the lower slopes of that mountain yeah so yeah all is good i'm gonna start doing the youtube channel again now i'm sort of pretty much three quarters settled into the house and uh starting to feel a little bit more relaxed every day Get up every morning, have my coffee, listening to the frogs and the birds. No, it's really beautiful, really laid back. And uh, even the foreigners here are a different brand of expat than what in Cha'am and Hua Hin and, you know, especially Bangkok. Down here, they just seem to be all really long timers and they're all really laid back and helpful, really helpful and, uh, you know, friendly. It's a great place. You know, the first bar I walked into, which I, I don't go to bars much anymore, I don't drink much, but the very first bar I walked into, the, but the guy who owns the bar handed me a bong over the counter. So, you know, it's uh, pretty open and pretty laid back here. I've, uh, I'll have a bit of a chat later. I want to have a bit of a, just a bit of water level view. You can see how crystal clear it is. At least see it. Yeah, so water level view of the surroundings. Royal Lanta Resort and Spa. There's a lot of hotels and restaurants here.
and out that way uh, a bit of diving going on out there you can see and further out that way is uh, as I've mentioned before in a couple of shorts I did Kopipi and uh, Phuket and up this way past that islet there is uh, Krabi this island is called Kotlantayai which means big the big island Lanta and in between this island and uh, Krabi is another smaller island which is called Kotlanta Noi Noi meaning small Ko I mean of course means island yeah so many people say Ko but it's not pronounced Ko it's pronounced Ko 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 Kotlanta Kotlanta Noi, Kotlanta Yai. And I live on Kotlanta Yai. Yeah, I've got plenty of time to do some uh, informational stuff and some stuff around town. Oh, I've got something on my lens, hang on a minute. Oh. Looks like it's got a bit of moisture inside the lens or the lens cover. I'll have to look into that when I get home. I'll get rid of that uh, close up of my melon. Okay, gonna have a swim and then I'll go for a walk along the beach. Here's the iPhone. There you have it. I'm in the water, it's beautiful. Onshore breeze has just come up, but that makes it nice and cool. Out. Okay, so I'm just going to go for a walk down the beach just to show you how pretty it is here. And for those people that want to visit, you may want to come and have a look at uh, some of the accommodations here. This place looks okay. You know, and of course they do, they have the massage things up there and stuff like that, you know. There are lots of bars on the beach, right the full length of Kotlanta. Okay, it looks like these uh, people are hotel guests, I, I would imagine, and uh, organising some sort of activities for children. Yeah, so, yeah, mini mart on the beach. Another bar over there, restaurant and bar. Of course, with the customary reggae colours. A lot of people walk the beach here. A lot of families come here for holidays and I think on a regular basis like every year or something like that too you know it appears that way anyway so you know a lot of restaurants and bars along the beach it's pretty it's very very pretty I quite enjoy it so this little place here Sala Cafe could end up being my go-to breakfast place. Quite nice and really good food and uh, reasonable pricing, very reasonable pricing. They make their own bread too, which is good. I don't know if they make the croissant. But yeah, got a good menu, Western and uh, Thai food. Good menu, great little place. Assalamu alaikum. So I'll get a menu and I'm gonna have some breakfast. Uh, good morning. I've just been editing the uh, video I shot yesterday. I'm, I'm a little bit out of practice, so you know, give me a little bit of room to move. I'll get back into it. I've gotta get used to my equipment again. I don't really like using the GoPro. I think the iPhone shoots much better video. But, you know, that's the way it is. Um, over the next couple of days, or this week sometime, I'll produce some more stuff. I'll get the drone out. I've been charging up all my batteries. They've been sitting there laying dormant for quite a while now. So I'll get the drone up. I'll uh, go and get a high point on the island so I can get up and hopefully get some drone footage of the whole island. 
and uh, you know a few other places of interest and whatnot you know so yeah I had a bit of trouble editing I've got a new monitor and it's absolute crap I wish I hadn't have bought it but you know that's the way it goes I used to use the TV which had really good color and allowed me to edit very well but I suppose I'll get used to this one it's a you know my com my laptop screen is, is too small for my eyes really so I need a monitor but you know maybe I'll get another one at some stage or other I don't know so bear with me while I um, get back into the swing of things and um, I'll produce some more video for you with some drone footage and some more places of interest around Kotlanta and then eventually I'll start um, uh, venturing out to uh, Krabi and some of the amazing places there. I might even do a trip over to Phuket or uh, to uh, Pipi. Uh, but there are, you know, a million and one videos of Pipi, but I'm sure you'd like to see it anyway. So I'll get over to Phuket at some stage or other. And uh, some other places around here, southern Thailand is extremely beautiful. It has been very wet. Wet season is just finishing. It seems to be dragging on a little bit, most of the locals have been telling me. Yeah, so I'll get back into it shortly and uh, start producing some more video for you and some interesting things around Kotlanta and Krabi and southern Thailand. Until then, ciao for now. Please subscribe to the channel or share the videos and then other people may subscribe. They may not, but they may subscribe, which will boost up my uh, numbers, etc. And uh, just helps me keep the channel, channel going. Keeps me a little bit inspired too, and I love the messages. You know that, I love getting messages from you guys. Okay, ciao for now.